Hello and welcome viewers and subscribers of AVG News. My name is Olisi, the son of Ngube, and I'm here just to respond to some messages that we've been getting from Zimbabweans, especially those that are based in South Africa, pertaining to what uh, appears uh, to be a, a, a statement or a notice from the Zimbabwean consulate uh, to the effect that there will be some mobile teams dispatched around South Africa to provide documentation to Zimbabwean citizens uh, that are based in this country. So they want to know if this indeed uh, is true. What we've discovered is that yes, there will be consular services that will be extended to some provinces in South Africa, two provinces in particular by the Zimbabwean consulate in Johannesburg. And this is carried out uh, in a, a notice that was given out by the Zimbabwean consulate, signed by the acting consulate general, uh, T. Sham Shambakumanja, uh, who said that during this period, uh, the teams, uh, that is the period to 9 to 25 November 2023, that is 9 to 25 November 2023, there will be teams, mobile teams, that will be dispatched, offering services uh, to Zimbabweans that are based in South Africa, in particularly those two provinces, that is the province uh, of um, Limpopo and Mpumalanga. So they'll be providing services that include birth certificate registration, passport form processing, temporary travel documents, that is TTD application, non-marriage applications, and verification of public documents, that is those documents that were issued uh, in Zimbabwe, like birth certificates, death certificates, marriage certificates, and passport, uh, among others. So what is happening is that in Limpopo province, the teams will be in Bukran, uh, that is at Mutlele, guest house, number one, extension five, Sinua Barwana, from 9 to 12 November 2023. They will be providing their services between 8.30 a.m. and 3 p.m. So what this means is that they will be opening at 8.30 a.m. and closing at 3 p.m. So if you are in Limpopo province, uh, just go to Bokan, that is at Mutlele guest house number one, extension five, Sinua, Sinua Barwana, from 9 to 12 November 2023. Then from 14 to 18 November uh, 2023, the teams will be in Puluwane, which is also in Limpopo province. They will be at Open View 135 Open Road, Evidale, from 8.30 a.m. to 3 p.m. They will be uh, uh, in Mpumalanga province from 23 to 25 November 2023. Uh, they will be uh, the officials will be at Kere from Red, that's Africans, Kerek Hovel, Post Pass 541, River Crescent, between 8.30 a.m. and 3 p.m. Uh, so this is where they will be. They will be operating uh, from uh, 8.30 to 15.30 hours during the stated dates so instead of three because at the top they said 3 p.m and then at the bottom they say 3 30 but for you to be safe just go there uh, planning on being safe between 8 30 a.m and 3 30 p.m please note that the service will be given on a first come first served basis the consulate urges the Zimbabwean community in the two provinces to take advantage of these mobile exercises to regularize their documents. So for more, you can visit uh, the consular general or the consulate's offices, I mean the consulate's website, that is www.zimbabweconsulate.co.za for comprehensive information on application requirements. Please note that the, embassy, the Zimbabwe Embassy in Pretoria and the two consulates, namely the Zimbabwe Consulate in Johannesburg 
and the Zimbabwe consulate in Cape Town do not have agents who act on their behalf. So this is an emphasis for further interaction with the consulate on all issues of mutual interest. Please use the following official channels. Facebook page, Zimbabwe Consulate, Boeing Road, Bedford View. Twitter, Zimbabwe Consulate, JHB. WhatsApp, plus 278282494935. Email, admin at zimbabweconsulate.co.za. Website, www.zimbabweconsulate.co dot z a so remember that this is what they will be offering this the services that they will be offering again is birth certificate registration passport form processing temporary travel document ttd application non-marriage applications for those that are here in south africa intending to marry someone who's not uh, of zimbabwean origin then verification of public documents that is Zimbabwean issued documents which include birth certificates, death certificates, marriage certificates, passports, etc. So thank you very much. This is what we had for you. Please continue to circulate this so that Zimbabweans, especially those that are based in or around those two provinces of Limpopo and Pumalanga, can then take advantage of this and be saved. As you know that Zimbabweans, many of them living in South Africa, have not had the opportunity to get some of the documents, especially also the children of Zimbabweans that were born and live in South Africa. So please circulate this, make sure that people see it. And if you are in and around that particular area, those two provinces, please make sure that you are indeed uh, there on the on those particular days so that you can have your documentation processed so that you can live legally in South Africa and uh, be more advantaged than those that do not have documents. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like this video, and share it. Thank you.